Hello Fat Stringers and Knowing Lovers and welcome to today's bass lesson. Okay, and today we have this kind of like Eastern droney thing, but it's got a darkness about it. Um, you could use it in rock and I uh, could use it in all sorts really. Uh, yeah, well, how we're gonna approach that, we have this like dr drone in this D string, this string here is just consistently droning out, which gives it that kind of like Eastern feel playing notes beneath it, uh, playing the melody if you will. And then we're just gonna do this like chromatic run up on the G string to get there. Right, okay, so what I want you to do is, your index finger come to the fifth fret on the G string right there. Yeah, your index finger. Okay, then you just just strum the D and the G strings together, right, with this hand here, obviously. Um, yeah. So you got this thing going on, D and G at the same time. Yeah. And then the rest of it is just basically in in this hand. This is the rhythm book we run. One. So. So we come to the 5th fret on the G string uh, and then come to the 7th uh, fret on the G string with your ring finger and do a hammer on. Just like that, yeah? And that's what we want. And then the rhythm is, I think we play... Yeah? Okay, and then all we do is... So... Up to the 7th fret, and then you're going to come up to the 10th fret on the G string with your uh, ring finger. Then how many times do you play that? One, two, three, four, five. I don't know, I think it's five, Just, but, but it's more of a rhythmic thing rather than working out how many times you actually do it. So try again. That's the uh, rhythm that you want. One more time. Okay, so, and the whole thing, so we're going to cover the 10th fret, the 11th fret, the 12th, and then the 13th, so like this. And play this one again, and again, to the 12th fret, then to the 13th fret, and again. D and the G string, you know, keep, keep this like moving, and then just take the G string, keep the D going, droning, just take the D string, move it anywhere. It, the world is your oyster, the world is your musical oyster, my friends. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed this bass lesson, and I shall see you in tomorrow's.